on the tube <laughs> with Joseph. Yes, we are. Running late as always. Just arriving at Wimbledon, a little bit late. We're now trying to find the clubhouse and then get into the real box. Uh, we're kind of a little bit not knowing where we are going. Should we go to the toilets? <laughs> <laughs> a royal might have peed there before. So many times. And still resisting Found the hole in the end. <laughs> what did you order, Joe? Monkfish. Monkfish? It's it like religious fish. Mmm, mm, lamb. So now in, we're now at Wimbledon and we're about to go into the Royal Box. We've sort of wait for a break and play. But unfortunately, no cameras allowed in the Royal Box. So Champagne though. Unfortunately, it's going to be have to kind of leave it at that. But, you know, we just had our lunch. Joe's on the champagne. Yes, it is. I'm on the Diet Coke, unfortunately. But excited to get out there and watch the tennis. <laughs> Gentlemen, what is it like being in the Watching from the Royal Box, what's it been like? I mean, it's been so surreal. So I've just done an interview with the BBC, for BBC One, and for Radio 5 Live, which is pretty cool. Joe filmed it, courtesy of Joe, um, on the balcony, and now I'm about to sign the visitors book before we go out and watch a bit more of Federer. So we just watched all of the matches here at Wimbledon and the Centre Court in the Royal Box. It's been amazing. We've seen Federer, Sharapova and Nadal all in one day, which has been pretty amazing for my first time ever watching tennis in real life. So it's uh, it's been pretty cool. I've had a really fun day and look out for the next video. If you like this video, then come across to my channel and don't forget to subscribe because there'll be lots of new videos coming soon. Clock, please. Play. Rain was the order of the day on Saturday, with many matches affected by the damp and dismal conditions. Only three times has there been play on the first Sunday, and that tradition is upheld this year. So what can we look forward to on Monday? The biggest casualty due to the weather was the clash between Stan Wawrinka and Dennis Istomin. Those two, along with Feliciano Lopez and John Isner, will have to wait until Monday to put their place in the last 16.